Today for Mousetrap Monday, we're going to test out a vintage metal mousetrap that has one of the most sensitive triggers I've ever seen, and that's because it's floating on a magnet. It's such a clever design, I've never seen anything like it before. Now usually the mousetraps I show you are very old, but actually this one's pretty new. I was even born when it was invented. It was first patented on September 25th, 1984, and it was assigned to the Star Trap Incorporated of Elk Grove Village, Illinois. It even says Star Trap right there, right below the metal teeth. Now to set it, we'll pull back the kill bar, and this lever locks in the trigger. Now this trigger is barely connected. It's floating on a magnet, making it one of the most sensitive triggers ever. If you barely set it right there, that is a hair trigger. Even the smallest mouse will come along, barely touch that, and get caught. And even though that spring's pretty small, that has a lot of force. It will definitely do the job. It's such a great design, and I can't wait to see if we can catch a mouse with it. As usual, we're going to set it up in the barn, but I don't want a squirrel or pack rat stealing my trap, so we're going to use our mouse trap box. We'll place it in the back here with the screen. We can see the trap going off. The mouse will enter, go down the tunnel, and get caught. Let's go set up the motion cameras and see if we can get a mouse with the magnetic star mouse trap. Wow, I'm really impressed by how sensitive the magnetic trigger is on the star mousetrap. As soon as the mouse went in there and tried to get the peanut butter, it instantly got caught. Now I don't want the mouse to go to waste, so I'm going to feed it to wild animals. Let's go set up the motion cameras and see what comes along and enjoys a mouse snack. Well, once again, our friend the skunk enjoyed the mouse we caught with the star mousetrap. Overall, it's basically just another copy of the standard snap trap, but what makes it so special is that floating magnetic trigger. It's so sensitive, even the slightest touch, and you'll catch a mouse. I love testing out different mousetrap designs, and this is a pretty special one. Thank you so much for watching my videos, and thanks to all the viewers who have sent me art. I love seeing the pictures. I also love seeing pictures of people's pets watching Mousetrap Mondays. If you haven't subscribed, please consider clicking that button. I've posted over 600 videos on YouTube and currently I'm posting new videos every Monday and Friday. So if you want to see the best videos on how to catch mice, rats, squirrels, chipmunks, moles, voles, and gophers, stay tuned.